It's a good time to fine tune that resume or dust off your best duds because according to the Minnesota Department of Employment and Economic Development, Rochester is just shy of creating 4,000 jobs from March of last year to now. KIMT News Series Sorrel Correa is finding out which industries could use your skills the most. Express Employment Recruiter Brad Trahan says candidates looking to get jobs has never been better than it has been in the past few months and there are a variety of industries looking to hire. Some of the industries looking to hire are manufacturing, hospitality, accounting and finance with Mayo Clinic investing $5 billion as part of their bold forward unbound initiative, Trahan says even more job growth is on the horizon. With everything going on in our community based on what Mayo is doing, um, other, there's going to be coffee shops, there's going to be hotels, there's going to be apartments, all that takes construction, all of it takes the trades, um, it, so there's going to be great opportunities. So it's, it's a very good healthy position to be in. Even though more people are getting hired, Trahan says it can be harder to make ends meet because of Rochester's cost of living. We still have some jobs out there that you know are paying anywhere from fifty to fifty-five thousand dollars a year. However, um, affordable housing, and then you take our current economic uh, status in terms of groceries, gas, inflation, all that's up. People can't make ends meet. You know that's why we're seeing people coming in and getting second jobs. Um, so I mean, the, the, we do got to figure out affordable housing. Trahan says when applying for jobs, it's important to understand the company's culture you're applying to and to have questions for hiring managers in your interview. Reporting from Rochester, I'm Cyril Cray, KIMT News 3. Deed also says Rochester's 3% job increase outpaced other cities in Minnesota like St. Cloud and Duluth.